this video we will try to solve for equilibrium consumption and equilibrium income from the given national income data the question is find c bar and y bar from the following we are being given y is equal to c plus i naught plus g naught y c denotes the consumption function i naught is autonomous investment and g naught is the autonomous government spending consumption function is c is equal to 25 plus 6 under root y where y denotes the income okay so given these factors let us first insert the value of c uh, into the first equation so our y will be equal to in place of c we have this consumption function 25 uh, plus 6 under root y okay then the value of i naught is being given as say 16 plus the value of g naught is 14 which gives us when we solve it will become y is equal to 25 plus 16 plus 14 when adding up them it will come out to be uh, you know 55 plus 6y okay here what will we do now let us transpose this 6 uh, sorry this uh, 55 to LHS so we have y minus 55 uh, is equal to 6 actually it is under root y here okay is equal to 6 under root y now what will we do we write it as it is y minus 55 uh, is equal to 6 under root y okay we square on both sides that is we write here square and here square okay so this is a minus b whole square which is equal to a square plus b square uh, minus 2 into a the value of y coefficient of y is 1 times b that is 55 okay so we have 2y into 55 should be equal to now if we expand this 6 6 is 36 square and root will get cancelled we will be left with only y okay so solving this is y square uh, plus it will become 3025 and this is minus uh, 2 into 55 is 110 y is equal to 36 y okay solving this we will get y square minus 146 y uh, plus 3025 is equal to 0 okay i have skipped some steps here you can check it out you will get this very equation here okay now let's use the quadratic equation formula to solve this here the coefficient of y square is 1 it is our a the coefficient of y is uh, minus 146 and c is our constant term using the quadratic uh, formula that is y will be equal to uh, let's write it capital y equilibrium y will be equal to minus b minus b plus minus b square minus 4 ac upon 2a okay let's give uh, the parameters their values so we have minus b is minus 146 so minus 146 plus minus b square minus minus 146 square okay uh, minus uh, 4 from the formula a is 1 and c is minus sorry our c is 3025 let's write it here 3025 upon twice a so the value of a is 1 here the coefficient of y here so this is plus uh, minus minus into minus into minus is plus we will get 146 plus minus solving this out 146 square it will become positive so we will get 21316 4 into 3025 it will come out to be 12100 i have calculated the values divided by 2 which comes out okay so we will get 146 uh, plus minus under root of 9216 9216 upon 2 solving again that means we will get 146 let me write it here 146 plus minus 9216 it will come out to be 96 upon 2 
that means we will get two values here what that is one is y uh, let me rub this out that means either our y will be equal to 146 plus 96 upon 2 which will come out to be 121 or our y will be equal to 146 minus 96 upon 2 which will come out to be 25 okay so we got two values for y now which of these will satisfy our given equation our uh, given equation was this okay this was our given equation let us see which of the y solves the uh, you know satisfies this equation uh, if i rewrite this equation in this fashion that is if i write this equation in this fashion that is y minus 6 under root y is equal to 55 now we have to see which of these two y's will satisfy this equation that will be our solution now if we put y is equal to 121 okay so we will get 121 minus 6 into 121 let us solve it this is 121 minus 6 121 is 11 so 66 121 minus 66 it will come out to be 55 okay that means lhs will be equal to this rhs okay and when y is equal to 25 in this equation so we will have 25 minus 6 under root 25 solving this we have 25 minus uh, 6 25 so it will become 5 okay so this is 6 5 is 30 we will get here minus 5 obviously minus 5 is not equal to 55 that means this will not satisfy our given equation that means our equilibrium level of income will be equal to 121 and corresponding to this what will be our equilibrium consumption so consumption will be equal to we have 25 just plug the equilibrium value of income in this equation so, so we have 6 under root 121 which gives us c is equal to 25 plus 6 uh, into 11 so our c will be equal to uh, 66 plus 25 it will come out to be 91 that means our equilibrium level of consumption will be 91 and equilibrium uh, level of income will be 1 sorry equilibrium level of consumption is 91 and equilibrium level of income is 121 i hope i make myself clear in this video thank you